right, hello everyone. Welcome back to Nanjing, China. Uh, yesterday when my wife got home from work, she was laughing and telling me how crazy the people here are. There was a two hour or two and a half hour line to buy milk tea. Apparently these, uh, this milk tea shop just opened up in Nanjing. It's from uh, Changsha city in uh, Hunan province. And she just couldn't get over how crazy this line was. Uh, it was right like at where she works, just downstairs. So the door to her office, like the door, the entrance to where she goes into work was like blocked and they couldn't use that door. There was all sorts of videos going around like the internet of just people waiting in this crazy, crazy long line just to get milk tea. But the thing is in China, like in Nanjing, there are milk tea stores everywhere. They're like super common. You can get milk tea everywhere. And she just couldn't understand. I mean, of course I can't understand either why someone would be willing to wait in like a, a two or three hour line to buy milk tea. So I was like, you know what? Today I'm gonna to come out here and see what the line is like. They were prepared today, because apparently yesterday it was really crazy, and there were like people like rushing the line and like going through the barriers, and it was just like insane. So today they had police here, lots of police, like, and the line, they had prepared like stuff on the ground um, so people knew where to stand, and they broke the line up. So like the line was, if the line went all the way outside, which it wasn't just now when I was there, they had prepared like police and like barricades and like a place for them to walk. And then they initially make them stand upstairs in the entrance of the building, like the entrance to where my wife works. And then there's like an escalator and they separate the line. So people have to get like a, like this little fan that says that they're in the line and then they can wait there. And then when the line downstairs, right in front of the, this is in the basement of the building, when it's uh, you know finished, when the line is open, I mean, there's space. People can go downstairs and wait there. And yesterday, the line went the other way. Like, all, it was only inside. And it was just crazy. Like, there was just, like, so many people down there. It was dangerous. So they changed the line to the way it is today. And when I was standing down there, I was leaving. And I was just standing in the subway where the original line was, um, where they, like, shut the door today. Some guy walked over to me. And he was like, do you want to buy milk tea? because like that's what people are doing. They're like downstairs waiting in that long line and then buying the milk tea and then trying to sell it to people who don't want to wait in the line. And so I'll just show you the video real quick. You can see what he said to me. Anyway, he was cool. He knew that I didn't want to actually buy the milk tea, but I told him I wanted to make a video. He said, it was cool, just don't film his face. You can see that like today he can make 13 or I don't know how many, how many dollars, about 12, maybe $12 or something to buy it himself and then sell it outside. But he said yesterday he could have made, you know, a lot more than that. Uh, I don't even know how much you have to, <laughs> I'll, put the, I'll put the amount here, the exact amount, but a lot. That's, it's pretty good for just standing in line for, for a little while. All right, so it's after lunch now and I just walked by the tea shop again when we we're going back to the metro to go home and I saw that same guy again and he was holding more tea. So I said, did you, are we already successful? Did you sell? the tea you had before. He's like, yeah, I already sold it. This is my second go. So he already sold the stuff he had before, waited in line again, bought more, and now he's selling, he's selling it. <laughs> oh man. And uh, also I was just standing there, just now filming, and um, all of a sudden some girl is like calling my name, and I'm like, hello. And she's like, you know, I was her, her teacher a few years ago, and like she recognized me, and so I did a little interview with her. You can pile a dojo. Huh? You can pile a dojo. Anyway, so it's just interesting, you know, people are willing to wait in such a long line. Like yesterday they waited hours and hours and hours just for milk tea. Today wasn't as bad, but still pretty crazy. I wouldn't wait, you know, for 30 or 40 yeah, what do you guys think about that? Is that uh, something you've ever seen where you're from? People willing to wait in such a long line just to buy a drink? I mean, I know people wait in line to buy like iPhones or like a new computer thing that just comes out, but just to buy milk tea? It's not something I've ever seen before where I'm from. But how about where you're from? Is that uh, 
a common occurrence where you're from, leave a comment below and, and let me know. And if this is your first time seeing one of my videos, please smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.